Hi, welcome to Zorantech on using talent data in Workday. In this video, we will cover how to find and compare workers, create and use talent pools, view talent matrix reports, add talent statements, and generate talent cards. Disclaimer The agenda for this module covers Find and compare workers Talent pools Security and talent pools Talent matrix reports Talent statements Talent cards The Find Workers report allows you to search and filter your workers by various criteria, such as location, job profile or potential assessment. As you select a value for any filter category or facet, the report is dynamically updated. Facet value counts are also displayed, to help you understand the worker population in each criterion. The facets on the Find Workers report are generic categories delivered by Workday. The values for the facets correspond to your specific tenant data. For example, the Job Profile facet will display your specific job profiles. The number next to the facet in parentheses indicates how many workers have that facet value. The Find Workers report is secured to the search, Find Worker domain. Individual facets are secured by the domain of their underlying report fields. Without view access to a facet's domain, Workday doesn't display that facet on the Find Workers report. Even if you have access, Workday only includes those employees whose data you have permission to see. This is an example of the Find Workers report, showing the various facets on the left that can be used to filter the results. Within the Find Workers report, a compare tool is available. This allows you to select workers to be compared and analyzed in a convenient side-by-side -side format. Key worker attributes in compensation, talent and work history are displayed in the comparison. Simply select workers by clicking the checkbox next to their name, and they will display across the top of the report. Selecting the compare button will open the compare workers report, with your selected workers and their information side-by-side. This is an example of the Compare Workers report, with two workers selected and their details displayed side by side for easy comparison. In the Compare Workers report, you can also click on the worker's name to drill down into their full worker profile for more details. Any faceted search can be saved and used later. For example, a search is made on the critical job facet with a value of yes and on the current performance rating facet with values of unsatisfactory or needs improvement. By clicking save and entering a name for the search, such as low performers in critical jobs, you can easily run the search again without selecting the facets. Click the open link at the top of the faceted search window to open saved searches. Click the save button to save a current search. This shows an example of saving a search in Find Workers, by clicking the Save button and entering a name. The saved searches can then be accessed using the open link. Talent pools are groups of workers that can be defined based on any criteria you wish. For example, you can create a talent pool of all Chinese-speaking instructors, because you may have a training engagement coming up in China and you would like to evaluate who would be a good candidate. Or you may want to create a talent pool of workers who have the skills and experience necessary for a new cross-functional project. You can create as many talent pools as you need for any purpose you want. Talent pools are groups of workers that can be defined based on any criteria you wish. For example, you can create a talent pool of all Chinese-speaking instructors, because you may have a training engagement coming up in China and you would like to evaluate who would be a good candidate. Or you may want to create a talent pool of workers who have the skills and experience necessary for a new cross-functional project. You can create as many talent pools as you need for any purpose you want. There are two methods for managing talent pools. Static, you manually maintain pool membership by tagging workers using the tag icon. Dynamic, Workday determines pool membership dynamically based on the results of a saved search. Use the Create Talent Pool task to create a static talent pool and add members based on manual selection. Once the workers are added as members, the talent pool remains static unless you manually add or delete workers. At least one assignable role, such as talent manager, needs to be associated with talent pools. 
This is done by creating a role and enabling it for the organization type of talent pool. It can also be configured so that whoever creates a talent pool is assigned that talent manager role. Use the Maintain Assignable Roles task for this. A Find Workers button will display when the talent pool is saved. Click on this to start the process of adding workers to the pool. To add the search results, that is, the group of workers currently returned by Find Workers, to a static talent pool, click the tag icon when viewing the entire set of workers. Then select the desired talent pool from the prompt and click OK. You can add up to 50 workers to the selected talent pool using this method. If you need to add more than 50 workers, tag the first 50, then tag the next group, and so on. A dynamic talent pool uses a search filter to dynamically determine the members of a talent pool when it is viewed or used. Dynamic talent pools are created the same way as static talent pools, but members are added based on a saved search. Searches saved in the Find Workers report are available to select. These talent pools will have the word dynamic added to their name, so it is clear that membership was determined dynamically. Talent pool information is only visible to those who have a role on the talent pool, regardless of their access to the workers or workers' organizations. Workers assigned to talent pool roles have broad access to talent pool member information. An HR partner, for example, may have security permission to create a talent pool, but without a role on the talent pool, that HR partner has no visibility to the members of the talent pool. The Restricted View checkbox when creating a talent pool allows you to restrict view to the talent pool members, based on role-based security. You also must give view access to the role-based security group on the talent pool, Restricted View domain. This screenshot shows the Restricted View checkbox on the Create Talent Pool page, which allows restricting access to talent pool members. This screenshot shows an example of a talent pool, with the members listed. Various actions like adding goals or tasks can be taken directly on the talent pool. This screenshot shows drilling into one of the talent pool members to view their worker profile and take actions like adding a goal or task for that individual. Talent matrix reports are based on current ratings data in Workday and have numerous interactive qualities. While viewing a talent matrix report, you can apply filter criteria and see instant results. You also can drill down on several items in the report to see and interact with the underlying worker details. Workday delivers five talent matrix reports. Talent matrix, potential by performance. Talent matrix, performance by base pay quartile. Talent matrix, performance by potential. Talent matrix, performance over time by potential. Talent matrix, performance by retention. Talent matrix, performance over time by competency. Talent matrix, performance by initiative importance. However, you can always create a custom talent matrix in Report Writer. Talent statements are brief professional descriptions about a person on their workday profile. You can write talent statements about yourself or others. You can edit or remove the statements you write. Talent statements can be used to support performance reviews, development discussions and career planning. On the professional profile, you can add, edit and view statements you write about yourself in the statements section. Only one statement of each type is available. This screenshot shows where talent statements can be added for yourself on the professional profile. There are sections for experience statement, strength statement and development statement. This screenshot shows where you can view talent statements others have written about you on the professional profile. A talent card is a one-page summary of a worker's key talent information that you can use as a tool for discussions on succession plans, short-term and long-term business plans, and retention of top talent. The talent card is defined by Workday and contains the worker's current personal and job data, skills and experience, talent summary and competencies, and career interests. Two versions of talent cards are available, those that reflect all of a worker's talent information as of the current date, and those that reflect a worker's talent information from a specific talent review. This is a screenshot of talent cards. Thank you for listening. Please subscribe to our channel for more informative videos on Workday.